If you carry a pistol for self-protection, you have to have a good holster with the emphasis on good. Thomas Tedder, Old Faithful Holsters now has a complete line of holsters. What makes these so good for concealed carry? Well, like it says right here, this is the world's stealthiest, most comfortable holster. It's not just a slogan, it's the truth. We built this from the ground up to be stealth first and comfort right there with it. We uh, do that with a great piece of leather. This okay. is the most expensive leather you're ever going to find. It's the best in the, it's actually made in America. It's, a, it's uh, really thick, it's comfortable, it's going to keep the gun, all those sharp points off your skin. Well, that's one of the things I was noticing. It's big enough to where you're not in contact with the gun at all. So yeah, that absolutely. makes it comfortable. And it's also wide enough to get these tabs out here and that's going to distribute the weight of the gun and keep it from pulling down in one spot on your waist. Right. And it, it looks like it's a lot, but it really isn't. When you get it in your pants, you're going to forget you're wearing it. Even this large XDM, you're not even going to notice that. It disappears. That. Now, one of the things that people may not understand is these clips are designed for tucking your shirt in so you wear it and you can still tuck your shirt in and conceal the pistol, right? right absolutely, Tom. Uh, just like you're dressed right now. In fact, like I'm dressed with a tucked in shirt. Right. You can see right here I'm wearing one. No, actually maybe I can't, can't see you here wearing <laughs> one. But here it is. Okay. And, uh, the, the reholster is one of the beauties of this. Look at that. The, the Kydex is gonna hold that open so you can just easily slap it right back yeah, in there you, you one handed. You don't want a holster that closes up because now you gotta use two hands to reholster, not yeah. safe. No, no, not at all. Okay, so you have different holsters here, obviously different models of pistols, but you were telling me now you have them set up where they'll take lights and lasers. Yeah, absolutely, Tom. We can do just about anything that Crimson Trace, Laser Light, or Laser Max makes. Uh, we don't do the large, huge tactical flashlights, but anything that can go underneath of right. the slide is pretty much in our lineup. We've got over 150 different combinations of guns and lasers. And a great display. Yes, sir. Uh, so if you don't see this in your local store, you know, uh, we need to find out how to get this. <laughs> Ask them why it's not there, because if you buy it from me, you've got to wait two weeks or maybe a month. Online, oh, I just walk in the store yeah. and get the one you need. Yeah, uh, these are in lots of dealers uh, all over the country, and so just go to your local store and find one and uh, pick out the holster you need right there. If you want to know more about it, it's oldfaithfulholsters.com. Simple as that. Good, comfortable holsters. Old Faithful Holsters, yeah, they're concealable, they're comfortable, but also you can adjust the retention. And we're not talking about retention holsters like the police officers wear, but we're just talking about how tight the holster holds your gun. And that's important because, as Clint Smith says, have you ever ended up in a fight? Have you ever ended up on the ground? Likelihood is you could end up on the ground if something crazy happens. So you want to be able to uh, retain your gun. And so what we're talking about here is when your gun comes out, one way to kind of test this would be when you're pushing your gun back in, it kind of clicks in place and it kind of holds it there. And you can see the gun doesn't just slide out with a little bit of uh, force. So, you know, do some handstands, hang upside down, see if your gun stays in its holster, and that's a pretty decent test. Um, so you can actually just turn the rings on this to tighten it down as much as you need to, and you can adjust the retention on this holster, which is great, depending on your gun. So I wanted to just shoot it and show you what it looks like. 